Hey everyone, my name is Kay Lonnie and welcome to Evergreen Adult Development Center. Today, we're going to be talking about one of our first series, which is personal groom and hygiene. And what I'm going to be talking about today is brushing our teeth. And I'm going to take you guys along the steps on how to brush our teeth. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first step is choosing our toothbrush. So what I have with me is a little kit that I brought from home and it has a toothbrush, a toothbrush covering and um, toothpaste. So what's so cool about toothbrushes is that they come in so many different colors and sizes. And just to give you guys an example, I brought two, two toothbrushes from home and this toothbrush is blue and red and this toothbrush is all black. So it just shows you the wide range of the different colors that toothbrushes can come in. And if you can see in the photos that we have is that there's toothbrushes that are purple, blue, green, and orange. So with me right now, let's get our toothbrushes and, and let's go on to the next step, which is choosing a toothpaste. So right here on the right side, there's three different brands that are kind of popular when it comes to toothpaste. And for me today, I'm gonna to be using Colgate, which is seen in the second picture right here. But what's so cool about toothpaste is that it comes in different flavors. There's so many different brands. It all depends on what kind of taste that you like. So for me, I think this, this, um, this flavor is mint. It's very fresh and it's a very clean type of feeling. So once we have our toothbrush and our toothpaste, let's go on to the second step, which is to apply the toothpaste on the toothbrush. So when we do that, we can see how to, we can see an example in this video right here of how it should look like. So what we do when we apply the toothpaste on the toothbrush is we squeeze, we squeeze the toothpaste bottle and we apply the toothpaste like this on the toothbrush so it looks like that and it's evenly kind of spread throughout the toothbrush so once we have our toothpaste on our toothbrush we can go ahead and go on to the third step which is to brush our teeth so when we brush our teeth there's two motions or two directions that we follow it's side to side and an up and down motion just like in the video right here that we can see the person or the character is going side to side, up and down, and that's how we brush our teeth. So when we brush our teeth, we make sure that we get all of our teeth and we go up and down like this or side to side to make sure all of our teeth are clean, all the food is out, and to leave our breath feeling nice and fresh. So that is how we brush our teeth. So let's move on to the fourth step. The fourth step is rinsing. So when we rinse our mouth, it's basically just getting all of the toothpaste out of our mouth and making sure that nothing is left behind from the toothpaste and all the soap from the toothpaste is gone. So what we do is we use water from the sink and we take a cup or we can use our hands too, but we take the cup and we put some water in there and then we put the water in our mouth but we cannot swallow. Let's make sure that we do not swallow the water because that's super important. So what we do is we take the water, we, we put it in our mouth and we swish the water around like this. And that is how we rinse our mouth. So after we swish it around our mouth, we spit it back out into the sink. So just like in this video right here, they rinse their mouth like this, and then right afterwards, we spit it back into the sink. And that is how we rinse. So next is we clean our toothbrush. And when we clean our toothbrush, after we're done brushing our teeth and rinsing our mouth, just like in the photo, we put our toothbrush, we turn on the water, we turn on the water and we put the um our toothbrush under the water and make sure all the toothpaste is gone to make sure our toothbrush is clean for the next time we use it 
So just like in this in this little video, we make sure we put the water and make sure we rinse it out to make sure all the toothpaste, can you see the toothpaste that's still left? Make sure that's all gone once we rinse it with water. So the next time we use it, our toothbrushes are clean again and the process repeats. So now it's time for an activity. So we're gonna do a little quiz to make sure that we know how to brush our teeth. Okay, so let's get right into it. What do we do first? Do we rinse our mouth first? Or do we place the toothpaste on the toothbrush first? So do we rinse our mouth first? Where we put the water in our mouth and we go like, or do we place the toothpaste on the toothbrush like that first? Let's see. Let's answer it. And the answer is B. B is the answer. Placing our toothpaste on our toothbrush is first. It's before we rinse our mouths. So what is the last step when brushing our teeth? Is it to clean our toothbrush and make sure that it's all clean for the next time we use it? Or do we brush our teeth? What is the last step? What is the final step when we brush our teeth? Is it cleaning our toothbrush in the water? Or is it brushing our teeth? So let's find out the answer. And the answer is A, it's cleaning our toothbrush. We need to make sure that our toothbrush is clean and we rinse it out with water to make sure all the toothpaste and all the soap is off of the toothbrush for the next time we use it. So here are some fun facts about brushing our teeth. And just to highlight a little key points from some of the talking points that I had earlier in the video. So there's different types of toothpaste and toothbrushes. Like I said before, there's this, there's different, for, tooth, for toothpaste, there's different flavors such as mint, cinnamon, bubble gum. It all depends on what you like. Like at home, I use a mint flavor, but there's people I know that use bubble gum. And like I said before, there's so many different types of toothbrushes. There's electric ones that are not manual and you can just turn on a button and it can just clean it for you. Or there's regular toothbrushes that look like this, but also there's, they come in different colors and different shapes. You can tell this one's bigger than this one. So it's so cool when brushing our teeth because there's so many different options. So with that, I really hope you had a wonderful time in this video with me. Thank you so much for listening. And I really hope that this was very helpful and that we were able to learn how to brush our teeth together. So thank you very much. See you soon.